In an era where technological supremacy is as contentious as territorial dominance, the semiconductor industry has become the newest battleground, exposing the geopolitical rifts between global superpowers. The United States, once the unchallenged titan in this high-stakes game, now watches as China, undeterred by sanctions and embargoes, forges ahead, seemingly turning obstacles into stepping stones towards semiconductor dominance. This unfolding drama is not just about chips, it's a stark portrayal of ambition, strategic maneuver, and the relentless pursuit of technological sovereignty. As China defiantly scales the semiconductor ladder, the U.S.'s attempts to clip its wings have sparked a contentious debate. Are these sanctions a necessary safeguard or a provocation fueling an unprecedented tech race? This is a saga of power, resilience, and the unyielding quest for innovation supremacy, where every move is critical and the stakes are higher than ever. Brace yourself for a narrative that doesn't just skim the surface, but dives deep into the murky waters of global tech politics. Stay with us till the end. It's a story you can't afford to miss. Hello and welcome back to Innovative Check YouTube channel, where we delve into the innovative and transformative projects changing our world. If you're new to the channel and enjoy learning about innovation stories around the world, you've come to the right place. Please subscribe, like, and comment to help boost our videos on YouTube. The semiconductor industry is poised for a significant rebound in 2024, led by advancements in artificial intelligence, I and driven by China's ambitious efforts to bolster its chip production capabilities. This resurgence comes despite the challenging global economic climate and the United States' efforts to impose restrictions on China's semiconductor sector. At the heart of this industry forecast is the report from SEMI, the global industry association representing the electronics manufacturing and design supply chain. According to SEMI's latest World Fab forecast report, the total global wafer capacity is expected to see a notable increase of 6.4% in 2024, reaching over 30 million wafers per month. This growth follows a 5.5% rise in the previous year, where the capacity reached 29.6 million WPM. Just a quick reminder to hit the like button below. YouTube has been restricting my videos a lot recently because of bots, so your like does help out this video massively in terms of the algorithm in YouTube. Semi's analysis suggests that this year's growth will be primarily fueled by cutting-edge logic foundries. Additionally, the rising demand in sectors such as generative AI and high-performance computing HP is likely to stimulate a broader recovery in chip demand. This optimistic outlook comes after a period of slowed capacity expansion in 2023, attributed to a dip in market demand for semiconductors and an inventory adjustment phase, where companies focused on utilizing existing stocks before placing new orders. This view is not unique to Semi. Gartner, another market analysis firm, also projected in December that the semiconductor market would bounce back this year. This rebound is largely attributed to the surging interest in AI, which is anticipated to particularly boost the demand for memory chips. In terms of specific market sectors, Semi predicts that the DRAM segment will grow by 5% to 4 million WPM in 2024. The 3DN flash sector is expected to see a 2% increase, reaching 3.7 million WPM. The discrete semiconductor capacity is forecasted to expand by 7% to 4.4 million WPM, and the analog capacity is set to grow by 10% to 2.4 million WPM. China's role in this recovery is particularly noteworthy. Despite the U.S.'s attempts to limit China's semiconductor development, Chinese chipmakers are expected to make significant strides. Semi-projects that China will commence operations of 18 new wafer fabrication projects in 2024. This expansion would represent a 13% increase in capacity, bringing it to 8.6 million WPM, following a 12% growth the previous year. Taiwan, maintaining its position as a key player in the semiconductor industry, is expected to see a 4.2% increase in capacity to 5.7 million WPM in 2024. Korea is projected to be in third place with an anticipated growth of 5.4%, reaching 5.1 million WPM, while Japan is forecasted to see a 2% increase in capacity to 4.7 million WPM. Globally, SEMI anticipates the commencement of 42 new fabrication plant projects in 2024, covering a range of wafer sizes from 100 mm to 300 mm. 
In the Americas, the semiconductor capacity is expected to grow by 6% to 3.1 million WPM, with six new fabrication plants. The Europe and Middle East region is forecasted to see a 3.6% increase in capacity to 2.7 million WPM, with four new plants coming online. This comprehensive overview of the semiconductor industry's forecast for 2024 underscores the dynamic and resilient nature of this sector. Despite geopolitical tensions and economic uncertainties, the drive for innovation and growth in the semiconductor space, particularly with the push from AI and other advanced technologies, continues unabated. The U.S. sanctions on China, aimed at curbing its semiconductor capabilities, have evidently not deterred China's ambitions in this field. Instead, these actions have possibly spurred China to accelerate its efforts towards self-sufficiency and leadership in the global semiconductor industry. If you are enjoying this video so far, please don't forget to subscribe, share the video and comment. China's aggressive expansion in semiconductor manufacturing, despite U.S. sanctions, indicates a strategic shift towards self-reliance in technology. This move is not just about expanding capacity. It's about developing an entire ecosystem that encompasses advanced chip design, manufacturing, and equipment. China's push to increase its semiconductor production Capacity is a direct response to the U.S. efforts to limit its access to cutting-edge semiconductor technology, particularly from companies like ASML, a leading supplier of photolithography systems used for chip manufacturing. This situation creates a complex dynamic in the global semiconductor industry. On one hand, the U.S. sanctions are intended to protect its technological edge and national security interests. On the other, these actions are accelerating China's investment in its own semiconductor industry, reducing its dependence on foreign technology. In the long term, this could lead to a more fragmented global technology landscape with distinct U.S. and Chinese technology ecosystems. The implications for global supply chains are significant. The semiconductor industry has traditionally been characterized by a highly integrated global supply chain with different stages of the semiconductor manufacturing process spread across various countries. The U.S. restrictions and China's consequent push for self-sufficiency could lead to a more regionalized approach to semiconductor manufacturing, potentially impacting the efficiency and cost-effectiveness of the global semiconductor supply chain. Moreover, the growth in semiconductor capacity, driven by the demand for AI and HPC applications, is creating new opportunities and challenges. AI and HPC require advanced semiconductor technologies to handle complex computations and vast amounts of data. This demand is pushing the boundaries of semiconductor technology, leading to innovations in chip design, materials, and manufacturing processes. These advancements are essential for the continued progress of AI and HPC technologies, which are becoming increasingly integral to a wide range of applications, from cloud computing to autonomous vehicles. The expansion in specific segments like DRAM and 3D and Flash is indicative of the growing data storage and processing requirements of the modern digital economy. As AI technologies become more widespread, the need for high-capacity, high-speed memory solutions will continue to rise. This trend presents significant opportunities for companies specializing in these technologies, as well as for regions that are ramping up their production capacities. In addition to China, other regions like Taiwan, Korea, Japan, the Americas, and Europe AT Middle East are also expanding their semiconductor capacities. This global expansion reflects the pervasive nature of semiconductor technology. Every region is striving to either maintain or enhance its position in the global semiconductor landscape. Recognizing the strategic importance of this industry in the broader context of economic development and national security. The semiconductor industry's growth trajectory in 2024 and beyond is thus not just a story of technological advancement, but also a narrative of geopolitical maneuvering, economic strategy, and the relentless pursuit of innovation. As this industry continues to evolve, it will undoubtedly play a pivotal role in shaping the technological and economic landscape of the future. Thank you for your attention, and I welcome your thoughts and questions on this complex and vital subject. Do you want to watch more videos like this one? If yes, please like and share the video and subscribe to get exclusive videos about how phenomenally China is developing and growing its influence. Your subscriptions and likes motivate us to generate more content, so please keep supporting us.
Check out this video showing on your screen right now, and I will see you on the other side.